So after Dam and Platinum breaking up with, um, you know, how many baby mamas now? There are three. He's always in and out of uh, relationships. This Tandale boy. So now the fans are like, you know what? We want to dare him to try out Akothe. And Akothe also said she wants to have a sixth baby with anyone without strings attached. So this could be just the perfect, perfect match between Dam and Platinum and Akothe. So my name is Julian and you tuned into the East African Social. Dam and Platinum has become the talk of town after deciding to do the unthinkable during International Women's Day, which fell on the eighth day of March. I don't know why this this boy, all the Waschanas who get out of his life, they always do on big days. Zari did this on Valentine's and then Tanasha decided to get tired on Women's Day. I don't know what, why, maybe they just want to feel some type of way and be relevant, but yeah, that's what happens. Now, the father of four who celebrated his baby mamas and exes was asked by a daring fan to get an equally strong-willed woman pregnant to prove he's the real man because this is what he wants to show the world. Instead of, you know, uh, mistreating these weak, weak women, the weaklings, eh? <laughs> Those brown, soft, tender, you try. Try a lure woman like who? Akothe. Alvin posted on social media and said, Who you boy from Tandale? Kamani Simba Kweli, Abasi, Amti, Akothi, Mimba. Make Akothi, Akothi pregnant. And then Akothi, of course, replied. She went onto her Instagram and also replied, My ovaries, <laughs> he etakua global. Vita via coronavirus versus rockast. <laughs> that is what she has said. Now, uh, guess who the strong-willed woman is? None other than, of course, the president of Single Mothers, Akothe, a.k.a. Esther. The mother of five shared a screenshot of the fan's comment on our social media and asked her followers to leave her in peace as she was trying to mind her own business. This boy from Tandale should prove he's a lion by impregnating me. <laughs> I don't think I can handle it. It would be a global war. The Muja singer even said if such a thing was to happen, her life would immediately turn into ruckus because she's uh, feisty and not the one to be messed with. You cannot mess with me. The only people you can try to mess with are my friends, Izo, uh, Wazari, you know, young girls like uh, Tanasha. But for me as a Kothe, you cannot handle me. You cannot handle all this juice. That is what she went and uh, commented. You can keep uh, part of this conversation as well. Be a part of it. Do you think that Diamond can handle Kothe? For me, I don't even think that she, he can even try. He's used to mistreating the stupid ones. But for Akothe, <laughs> he's a virtue uh, another day. My name is Juliana. You tune into the East African Social. Don't you forget to be a part of the channel by simply clicking on subscribe. Also, touch the notification bell as we continue dissecting these manenos of, uh, you know, the East African celebrities, especially Diamond and all the ruckus that happens in his life. Now, what we have also learned again is that Tanasha and Zari, I don't know now, they are both exes to this person. Why are they again, you know, starting to troll each other and talk about each other and fight? The story that I'm working on next, that's why you need to tune to East Africa. Zari says Tanasha used to stalk her on Instagram. And then today, Tanasha has gone about to do what? To respond to these claims. So keep it here. Keep it tuned. And of course, all those stories about your celebrities will be given to you live and clear. My name is Juliana. Hey, 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 hey,